so um, this Instagram page and this artist I mean it's actually a couple one is an artist and the other one is acting like a social media manager uh, this is their Instagram profile and since the time zones are all over the place I kind of didn't see their message and thankfully they contacted me on DMs and Instagram and they were like, hey, uh, we like your art style, can you please check our Instagram page, our Instagram profile, pick an OC and draw it. And I was like, I was like, yes, 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 please. Um, and I was so surprised by the colors, like they were like, whoa. And of course, the first one that got into my like view was this OC, Dolores, because of the of the big contrast, like dark and cool colors, because of the hairstyle, because it kind of looks like mine. So I was like, yes. But at the same time, like, no, let's 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 dive deep and let's explore. Okay, let's explore. And then I saw this one. I was like, damn, that's cool, and, and you read the description, and, and you're like, damn, they actually put thought into the design, damn it, you see Dolores once again, Dolores, and then, I mean, I went further here, but I saw this one, and I was like, damn, and I asked, uh, and I, I was like, yeah, I want to do this check, and I asked, and I asked them, like, okay, would it be fine? Uh, like, should I go with a more modern look? Or should I go with my fantasy style? Like, they were like, oh, <laughs> do it as you please. I was like, hell yeah. And I want to fit her into my universe. I think it would be pretty interesting. Um, considering all these lights, I believe that she would be a light user. That means that she would have a lot of light yellow and yellow in her palette so I need to think of that and also like the belts I think that's going to be cool as well when it comes to fashion or her origin place now I have if, if, if you know me from this channel alone then you don't know about the world but there's a whole I'm sorry friends congratulating me on a fiber order um, but there's a whole world with continents, with different cultures and stuff, so now I'm thinking like, damn. Um, I think this would be more like Rhone. Rhone is a flying city ruled by one man who's also like a religious figure and all of that. And so many people believe in him. And the mechanic is like, the more people believe in you, the more powerful you get. So he basically isn't even mortal anymore, he actually became a deity. And they have a lot of like geometrical shapes. Like their clothing is plain, no texture, no prints, it's just geometric shapes. And I don't know, I think like it's going to go well with her. Like some kind of rebel from Roan. And since she has a lot of yellows and blues, wait, let me, let me pop it in my head. Um, or should we just go with the color wheel? Let's go with the color wheel. Um, yeah, yeah, okay, let's go with the color. So we have something like this and something like this. So by, let's go with like triad, so let's say red, so I could put her in the Firelands. Firelands is a place like very tribal, like medieval tribal, it's, it's complicated, <laughs> I still didn't completely work it out, but the Firelands, yes. Yeah. She is probably a light bearer that descended from Rhone, and bear in mind, Rhone, as I said, is a flying city. Those who live there never touch the ground, like the ground in their lifetimes. But she ran down, stepped onto that bloody, filthy soil, according to their religion, and set out to a pilgrimage to the very end of the world. I don't know why, but. 
I have the whole day, I mean night, to figure it out. And tomorrow I'm going to paint it and I was thinking of making it something like a splash art. She looks like a like a badass character. Like bubblegum but still shoot you in the face. I don't know. That's that's what I got from it. Here is me again. I just wanted to round up the experience of having my first gig and first paid commission. So we're just going to look through how does it all look at the end of it. So here it is. Um, my order ID, how much I got paid, and when I saw this number, I was just uh, after posting this, like below down below, you can like choose to to finally post and. As you see, I included the source file and the painting, so they can like look and see what I did and how I did it. After that, I I was like, Phew. are you going to accept it or not? I my mini pizzas already. Are you going to accept it or not? I was so nervous, and but I went to eat, and while I was eating, I got an email that I got it, and I was like. No way! And, and I came back and I sat down here and I was like, <sighs> and I almost cried and I was so thankful and I was so happy and uh, I just don't know what to do with myself. So down below, right be below this, you're going to see, you would be able to see my personal message to them. I'm going to skip that and I'm just going to show you the rest. So here it is. This is the preview. Before they pay you, this preview is covered with a fiber symbol, so that's pretty nice. Um, I, I was very scared because I also had the option to have revisions. So when I sent a revision, I was scared that maybe they were like... I, I sent a sketch in DMs because I don't know how revisions work. And, and they were like... They, they didn't just screenshot it and rip me off and stuff. So I was very paranoid about that. Uh, you, you can see here their review, both of them the job, drawing of the character, keep up the good work, they're friendly and accommodating and just And of course I had to write um, back at them. I don't know, this was a wonderful experience. They were extremely supportive, like because of the time zones, as I said, they sent the message at 1 a.m. and I wasn't home, so I didn't have access to laptop and they mailed me. <laughs> Thankfully, they DM me on Instagram so I could like get to work as quickly as possible. They were really wonderful. Uh, now, I just wanted to shout out my Instagram page. That would be it. Have a have an amazing day.
Also, the mini pizzas turned out amazing.